All right, let's go. Oh my god, what was that? I told you it wasn't the end. Okay, I knew we'd fight him. I... I know, I know, I know all too well. Okay, oh yes, we are not properly prepared. Oh, can I get there from here? Probably not. Psych! Okay. You know what? I'm gonna try the strategy like last time with Stealth Rock, okay? Any new water moves? Yeah, totally. Oh! Oh! <gasps> no way, man. No way. Okay, it's not gonna be this episode, but maybe off camera or next episode. That's that's the one. That's that that's that, that's actually the one. Oh my days! Finally, he's actually gonna learn a water move. I could cry right about now, but I'm not because I'm a man. I love how that, I, dude, I think everyone's gonna be so happy. They're like, oh my god, like, look at. I never noticed that. It's like, oh, everything's so normal. We're just chilling. And then we're just, we're just gonna have some big Pokemon battle. It's gonna kill everybody. What up? Oh, I should have saved after. Oh, no. What's up, man? Clive? Yeah. No, I'm just gonna say it. It's you. Oh, come on. The name's Clive, remember? Actually, no. It's time for me to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. Aha! I wonder who it is. Oh my god, it's the professor. Wow. I do apologize for deceiving you with my disguise. In truth, the boy you knew as Clive was none other than the director of Evo Academy, Mr. Clavel. I didn't know that. What? But my disguise was perfect! Although, now that I think about it, I did neglect to keep you- to keep up my youthful act on a few occasions. That must have been got what gave me away. Regardless, there is still one more astonishing truth I must reveal to you. The true identity of Casapia, the big boss of Team Star, was me all along? That's literally impossible. Honest to goodness. When you heard Casapia over the phone, that was actually a pre-recorded voice. I pulled it off using, er, you know, one of those high-tech gizmos. Oh yes, it was very clever. This is stupid. So, Master Ben, now that you learned the uh, gnome, the big... This is just embarrassing. Like, I'm not even... Now that you know I'm the big boss, that means there's one thing left to do. I mean, I guess it makes sense, because you know he wants Team Star to, like, go, and, like, all the students to come back. Like, why couldn't it be, like, one of his friends? Why does it have to be him? Face me in one final showdown to decide it all. Why are you, like, fighting me? What? This is so stupid. What? I'm just... Oh, my God. I'm at a loss. I really am. I'm just I'm just shocked. We're having this freaking Pokemon battle in the middle. I'm Caspia of Team Star with this battle. I'll finally bring Operation Starfall to an end. You can't do multiple? 
That's ridiculous. Oh, miss me with that. Oh, it doesn't affect me. Boo hoo. Huh. Well, let's try this then. Freaking missed it. Great. Okay. Well, here we go then. He's not a normal type? Okay, I'm just... Oh, come on. This guy, this is probably gonna be the most scuffed battle you've ever seen. You probably wanna, you, you should avert your eyes. Honestly. Just why not, I don't know. Okay, uh, you're done after this one. Okay, uh... Foul pl oh, he'll be fine. Told ya. What?! He's not a fighting type?! Okay... I could've sworn he was. Okay, thank god. Oh, don't tell me you fall asleep now! Okay, thank god. Oh, he is asleep. Okay, well... <laughs> Obama Snow! Oh! Huh. I sure hope this Pokemon is not both ice and grass that are both weak to fire. That just, that would be a travesty. Hit him. One shot, one kill. I don't even need you, you know. 4x, baby. Poltergeist. Oh, it's a ghost, so. Oh, it's ice and ghost, actually. My bad. It's fine, he's got it. Oh, that's not the one I'm thinking of. <laughs> oh, a uh, ghost does do well, though. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Oh, miss me with that. I got the baked body. That sounded weird, I'm sorry. Oh, great. Oh, God, we are. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh god. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Okay, we gotta do this quickly. We gotta do this quick. What what did I just tell you? What did I just tell you? It doesn't work. God, you're so pathetic. The snow stop, yeah. Oh god. I can't do the Titan because even though he does have the water move, he doesn't even have a water move. Why am I worrying about it? <laughs> he doesn't have a water move yet, so that is.
Nice. Okay. Oh, wait. He's going to be faster, isn't he? Ooh. Please, 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 please. Oh, no. This is going to kill me. Dang it. I tried, man. I tried. Why not? I probably should have healed him, though. I don't think it would have made any difference. You're done. <laughs> it, it's, it's him. <laughs> Do it again. Interesting. I don't know why I keep forgetting that bug is not, I mean, poison is not, okay, what is your deal? I, I just assume poison is super effective against grass, bug is basically grass, the same thing. I don't know. Alright, oh, he's going to Terrilistize, so. Quack wabal. I'm googling that. Oh, that's really interesting, actually. Uh, keep him out. To think that Castle Pierre could be backed into a corner like this, dude. This is just—I'm so, just—I'm just so like, I'm just so disappointed, honestly. Like, it's not even like an exciting battle. Like this music is like what? Like, there's, like, nothing exciting about this. Like, for real. Very well, since I have to trillistize my Pokemon. Yeah, I just... Um... Like, you know, like, all, like, the rival... Like, the... Like, all of them. Every, like, bad guy before. Like, the final boss of the boss is, like, the coolest thing ever. This. This. This is what it is. Let's make it dangerous. Like, Okay then, whatever. Uh, should he get healed up though? Probably. I'm just, I'm just so I'm just so disappointed. I am like this is this is like actually pathetic. Big boss, by the way. Oh, he's big, big trash. Absolute big trash. Okay. Oh my god, man. This is this is the worst. This is just the actual worst. Why not? Great, okay, fine. I'm not too phased by it right now. This this is so suck this is such a sucky battle man, I can't even What up? I can do it too. What? 
Oh, never mind, it's good. It's all good. I gave him I gave him a bird if you didn't. Uh, you didn't see it, you know. So we're done. Okay, end this stupid battle, man. This is so This is just so insulting, okay? To every other like villain final boss, this is just insulting. Maybe it makes every everyone else look like godsends. You suck. You suck. How strong you've grown. Shut your mouth. You suck. Dear God. This is the best they could come up with. This. Well, no, Master Ben seems to go quite splendidly. Of course, I try. Oh, shut up. Just shut up. I'm sick of you, man. This is, this is so insulting. And you are once again, I must apologize, I'm not actually Castle though Clive and myself being the same person was no lie, mind you. Castle true identity remains hidden, but I believe I can hazard a guess as to who they might be. This is why I sought to spare you from having to confront them in battle. Their sorrows should not be yours to bear. What? Oh my god, this is so stupid. Castle PA has settled on a course of action that and is determined to see it through. I do not imagine any ordinary student could hope to stand against them and win, so I challenge you to a battle to test your skill. If you had lost, it would have fallen to me to bring down Castle PA, which was my resolve. But it turns out you are strong as you are kind. If anyone has a chance of saving that poor child, it surely is you. Oh my god, it's Penny. It's freaking Penny. Oh my. As an educator, it shames me to burden one of my students with such a task, but please defeat Kessel PA. Take on the big boss of Team Star and win. No, I'm not giving you, sir. You can just bugger off. Thank you for the bottom of my heart. Leave this in your hands. You. What the heck? What do you think you're doing? Hi? Miss Time, a pleasure to meet you. Who is this woman? It's no pleasure at all, Mr. Cavill Clavel. I came to investigate reports of an illicit battle on school grounds. And what do I find? Why the director of the academy himself is not against one of our students, no less. What were you thinking? Ah, uh, no, if I could just explain, you see, it's a rather sad tale. Oh, spare me. Your excuses reek worse than the stumpties behind. <laughs> Ahem. Remember, the big boss asked us to meet them in the schoolyard after dark. I'm counting on you, Master Ben. You write a letter of apology to the students, the faculty, and once reporting to chair of the school board. Make no mistake. Good gracious. No, anything but that. I implore you. And so now what? I already did it. Okay, no, get back. Okay, dude, I'm, I don't even know anymore. Okay, hold up. I'm gonna save, and I'm just gonna, like, see what it is. So now what? Gotta go in? What? I'm just, I'm just so, I'm just so flabbergasted. It's right here. No. Uh, yes. Might as well check this out. I still gotta fight. Okay, can you please tell me what is going on? Oh, why, hello, Master Ben. How's your treasure hunt coming along? Having all sorts of fun adventures, I hope? Yeah, it's been great. Wonderful, I'm glad to hear it. Do keep in mind the treasure hunt has no set course or criteria. 
Simply go where your heart takes you and you should just splendidly. Speaking of pursuits, there's been something on my mind of late. I could ask you for your expertise on the matter. It would be most grateful. You see, I recently heard a word whose meaning escapes me. I believe it to be some sort of slang. And what does Shui mean? I don't know, man. I see. So one might say to this, listen, was the Shui gist, is that right? The words used by young people these days are quite often beyond my comprehension. But when I learn the means behind the words, I find that I feel that much closer to my students. I'm most grateful to you for your help on that front. Dude, I don't even... I'm gonna check out the dorm, I don't... What am I supposed to do? It's like not complete. Freaking nothing has changed here. Get me out. It still says it's here, but there's nothing. Okay, what what am I supposed to do? No, I just Like, what? What? I did already- Like, what do you- What? What? What am I supposed to do? Jesus Christ, this is so- So stupid! Why can't I just fight the actual guy, huh? Gotta be- be a lot easier. Jesus Christ, man. This is so idiotic. Schoolyard. Okay, well. I'm doing it. I don't care. I just freaking... Sp I looked up. It's freaking... It's Penny! I knew it! I'm getting this over with. I don't care. I'm done with this. I'm sick and tired of this. I know, okay? I know. Schoolyard. Let's go. I'm, I'm, I'm finishing this, man. I'm tired of it. Yep, here we go. It's Penny. Wow. So stupid. I know it's a dumb kids game, but God. Thanks for coming. Oh my god, it's Penny. I'm so shocked. Wow. Don't give me that look, man. I should have said it before. Uh, blah. This must be quite a shock for you. The big boss, Casapia. They were both me all along. When I saw you make quick work of those team star lackeys outside that school that time, the idea for Operation Starfall suddenly came to me. My skills let me get a hold of much as much LP as I want, so I decided to use that to tempt you into helping me out. After the operation started, I kept an eye on you as a member of the supply unit. I had you battle the bosses on my behalf, all for the goal of defeating me and putting an end to Team Star once and for all. But still, there's part of me that wants Team Star to live on. I can't just roll over and let you win without putting up a fight. This is so stupid. Final showdown, are you ready? Yeah. Actually, you know what? Not just yet. Not just yet, okay? This is so stupid. Why well, I gotta fight two bozos? Freaking last game. Big, big stage. Big boss, you know. When I get here, a freaking, like, schoolyard fight. What is this?
Oh my god. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go! Enough, man! Oh for god's sake. Can I just fight? And get it this over with? Sorry to keep you the level of your apology. Miss Tame had me, er, I mean, preparations took longer than expected. That voice, are you Clive? Penny. So it was you after. Ah, no, I mean, is that you, Casapia? In the flesh, I've got a task for you, Clive, if you accept it. I want you to record what happens next so I can send the video to Team Star. They need to see the outcome of this battle for themselves. <laughs> okay, we'll do. Let's go in. Come on. Come on! Allow me to introduce myself properly. I'm the big boss of Team Star. His name's Casapia. No, Penny. Now bow down before the overwhelming might of Team Star's founder. This is so stupid, man. I can't believe this crap. Let's go, I'm tired. I'm just go, 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 go. I will hold back to this battle. Stay true to Team Star's code, yeah. Okay, I might hate you, but God, your song is fire! Hello! Oh my god, can we like not fight and like jam for a minute? Jesus defend Oh come on. You got another one in you? I'm not going to survive another one. Uh, yeah, why not? I knew it. And guess what? I got, I got more dog in me. Are you serious right now? What? Again? Dude, come on, please. Oh, bro, come on, please. Oh, thank God, man. What is wrong with you? You should have been dead last turn. Flareon. Ooh. Oh, dude, he's like beat up. Hmm. Jeez, oh, man. Okay, I need to check his defense stats because... 165? What? Okay, I... His highest stat, and he still is, like, bends to the knee with any attack. Like, what on earth? High defense, my butt, man. <sighs> okay. And we're gonna do a little... Oh, he's part bug, isn't... No, he's not. I'm not. What? Uh, we'll hit him with... No. He'll be good. With this. If he's not tough. Oh, dear. Yeah, that'll do it. Poison touch? Nope. Okay. Oh, he's got recoil. You know what? I guess I didn't have to worry about it at all. Never knew he'd have that big of a move, but you know what? It's whatever. Okay, whatever. You're dead. 
I guess it sort of worked out in a way. Vaporeon, yep. You know who's the man? You know who's the man? I mean, w women. You know what I meant. I'm faster. Huh. What? Okay, dude. I see how it is. Man, come on. Why do I be why do I be like that? Why do you guys be such a what got be such a clown? There you go. Finish the job. All the evolutions. Okay, well. You already know who's the man. I worked that guy. I got work that time. No! I. I clicked the wrong button. Dear God, I, I did. Great. Such an idiot, man. I'm. I want to get this episode all done so quickly that I'm just fat fingering. Okay. Oh, is can he take another one of those? Well, I guess it doesn't matter now. Oh, you bugger. Dude, it doesn't matter. You're literally, you're, you are at one HP. You're dead. Okay. Uh, is it bad that I now realize that all of her Pokemon are evolutions? <laughs> oh my god. I mean, I guess it's cute. Yep. Uh, hey, big bad over here. Evolutions. Yep. Makes sense. You're done. Sylveon! Okay. Oh, I'm part ghost. Oh, God. I can't fall on you on your skill. Battle skills, I don't know why your boss fell out of your hands. Yeah, okay. Well, shut up. I mean, I might as well. I already know you're gonna do it. Wait, she's not? Have I been- have I been bamboozled? Time to Tarillus- okay, yeah, I knew it. I knew it, yeah, I- I mean- I did mine first, so I- did, I kind of assumed that- You know, whatever. Cool, whatever. Not too bad. Oh! Okay. Uh, might as well. Yeah, it didn't really work as much as I thought. Mm. 
Man. Come on, get this over with! My VV Pal will crush you into stardust. Yeah, whatever. Come on then. Oh god, that might kill me actually. No, it won't. End this once and for all. I'm done! <sighs> god, I was not gonna wait this battle for next episode. I'm getting it over with. Yeah, I know, I just go, go, go. Explosion? Why? Hey, camera battery, camera battery, when is just feeling what I'm feeling. <laughs> like death. Okay. <sighs> Ugh. No. No. My face could just get out of my face. It's all over now. Yeah, shut, just shut your mouth. Say what you're gonna say. Say it quickly. I'm done. I'm so so tired, man. I'm so tired. It's finally over, guys. It's done. Who are you talking to? Oh my days. We're done here. I think we should call it quits. Hold up, are you saying we should break up the team? You gotta be joking. We got carried away with Operation Star and everything's gotten out of hand. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you when you round up a bunch of bullies in the courtyard and make a show of learning them some manners. But we didn't fight them to the end. Because I know the freaking low battery. I know. Ugh. <sighs> Indeed, merely we did declare our indication to battle tooth and nail should the villains persist in their tyrannous oppression so this was bloodless victory, we assure you. Shut up. Sorry. Yeah, they didn't even send out their Pokemon. They just blubbered and apologized a whole lot. Our outfits must have spooked them for good. But the bullies made a huge stink about what went down. They didn't want to believe in the academy. Our plan backfired epically. There's no way we're getting off scot-free. I guess you're right. This little stunt might have put us up in the creek. I'll fix this mess on my end. Just leave it to me. What are you saying? I'm the one who started Team Star. I dragged you all into this. I'll take this responsibility for everything. Oh, noble, unkind, big boss. You cannot. Now that the boys are gone, you guys should be start going to school again. Oh yeah, what about you? I can't go back. Why? There's no reason for you to stay shut in your room anymore, right? All I can say to you guys is thanks. Even though we never met in person, you were all so kind to me. Stop right there, BB. Okay. Uh, why are you talking like we'll never speak again? I need to go take care of some things. Pretty, speak to us. What is thine intent? Hey, Big Boss, answer us. Bye-bye, guys. Thanks for everything. That's a nice cinematic shot, I'm not gonna lie. We done? Ah. <sighs> Thanks for everything, Ben, and you too, Clive. I'm glad I could see this through to the end. I guess this is it for Team Star and me too. Hold that thought, Ms. Ah, Penny, I'd like to check something with you first. Check what? Why was there something like Operation Star for all if you're the big boss of Team Star? Wasn't there any other way to handle this? I tried telling the bosses that we were done once before, but they still didn't quit. I'd simply order them to. Our code states that no one in the team has been has the right to order people around. I could ask them all to do stuff, but I can never order them. One of these stupid rules. So it's back to the code once again. The bosses must have taken it very seriously. They did. And that's why I knew I could use it to force Team Star to disband. Because the bosses would do anything the code required for them. Why even leave the team? Yes, according to the code, they had a separate challenge and made to them. Thus the idea of Operation Star Fall. Castle PA, let me tell you one last thing. What does Team Star know? What do your friends in the team mean to you? There. They're my greatest treasure. Wow, what a textbook ending. Splendid, thank you for praising me 
of the situation, Miss Penny. What? Now, young lady, there's something I should very much like to discuss with you. Hey, quit it with the old geezer act, Clyde, but creeping me out. Indeed, well then, before we talk further, allow me to reveal to you my own secret identity. <sighs> Just as Caspia was your disguise, the boy you knew as Clyde was mine. But why? I needed a way to talk to Team Star on equal terms. Students do not tend to shy from speaking their mind to teachers, after all, much more so when they face with the director of the academy. Yeah. <laughs> Where do I even start? Was the outfit a bit much? Plus, I have some big feelings about that wig. Ahem, well, that's quite enough of that for now. Everybody, why don't you come on out? Who? Oh, freaking cutscene. Yeah. Oh, now we know is long time no see. Momo. Frick is Mo. Who is more like non long time no meet, right? I mean, we only found out about your real name just now. Mealy. Birdsey is along with the cipher source. Shut up. Start your Shakespeare language. Atticious. So, um, I heard your real name's Penny. How have you been this whole time? Orti. That's not his name. What's stupid nicknames? We found you at last. You have no idea how weird we've been. Eerie. No, it's Riri, you freaking idiot. Okay, gang, on the count of three. One, two. Uh, Hasla V Star, Kesukia, and Hello Penny. Jeepers Creepers, man. Now then, Miss Penny, and each of you young bosses as well. On behalf of the Academy, I have something I would like to say to Team Star. You all have my sincerest apologies. Come again? As Director of the Academy, I let you down. My handling of your situation was a dismal failure. What? I still don't, I don't know mean why. You all told me about your reasons for forming Team Star and about your subsequent actions. Ever since my first days of director, all I've ever experienced with the Academy was an environment blessedly free from bullying. I know this piece was built on the backs of your heart and anger, and of course, your immense courage in putting things to right, and so I'll get straight to the conclusion. The Academy's order from Team Star to disband and my threat to expel those who did not obey are hereby revoked. Does that mean what I think it means? Indeed, Team Star can continue to exist should that be your wish. What? Woohoo, Penny, isn't this great? Now we can all stay together. Oh, my heart is giddy with glee. But I betrayed all of you. You mean Operation Starfall? Director Clavel told us all about it. Or as we heard, you only went through with it to save us from getting expelled. You were just worried about us, right? Not like we ever chucked the team just because someone told us to after all, it ain't our style. I cannot even begin to imagine how you must have feared for us, Lady Penny. Sorry for making you worry, BB. We're all okay now, but even so. God, get this over with, man! Hold on, everyone. I have more to say. Ugh. As previously stated, the requ requirement for Team Star to disband has been revoked. However, there are still some unsettled manners to discuss. Allow me to provide a few examples. Your pro procreate traits and tunes, your brazen customization of your school uniforms, your unauthorized use of academy equipment, your reckless modification and jeopardization of driving a Pokemon power vehicles, Nyanaguan, your flagrant disregard for school rules cannot simply be overlooked. Yeah, punish them for real. I'm, I'm sick of it. Thus, as punishment, you will all be required to engage in community service. Community service? Yes, yeah, specifically, I'll be asking you to manage the STCs. And that stands for the Star Training Centers. There should be facilities for cult cultivating Pokemon trainers' talents. I plan for the Academy to found them in collaboration with the Pokemon League. The idea came to me when I saw Master Ben Bell on his way through your bases. The base of construction, as well as the battle tactics employed by students of Team Star, are remarkably unique and creative. I would ask that you continue your team activities, but henceforth as STC staff managers, using your former bases as training facilities. As a summit, does anyone have any concerns? Sounds like fun. 
So I don't see how this would anything but a win-win. It's maybe a weird thing to say since the STCs are supposed to be punishment and all, but you should totally join in too, Penny. It is true. We should most happily hear have you at our sides, my lady. We can go to school together too. That way, if anything happens, we'll be there to protect you. We were already talking about how great it would be to have both teams starting in school in our lives. That'd be a sweet deal for us. I'm so out of it, man. You have no idea. So what do you say? Guys, man, what do you think? Just do it. I, I just what? I what? I what? Then spill it out. When did you give your response right this moment, Penny? You take some time to decide. For now, at least I think our little group should go their separate ways. Ah, uh, not to say you should break up Team Star after all. Simply met. It's time to leave. Master Ben, please stop by my office later if you would. I did! Okay, I guess... I guess I'm not done until it says past. Let's go. Just get this freaking episode over with, man. It's been like... We're clocking two hours for real. Yeah, all right, Master Ben, I want to thank you for your hard work in resolving the situation with Team Star. If not for you, I suspect I would have done the team a grievous injustice and choice of my punishment for their actions. You have my sincerest gratitude. Uh, who's knocking? Who is it? I'm Miss Penny. Wow. I'm Miss Penny. Do come in. Hello, Director. About the STCs. I'd like to work on them together with the rest of Team Star. That's wonderful news. Thank you very much for your favorable response. But, um... I should be punished more heavily than the others, I think. Why so? Because of Operation Starfall? No, not that. Because of the other really bad thing I did. And what would that be? Um, you know the LP I gave you in both exchange for helping me with Operation Starfall? I sort I got a hold of it sort of illegally by hacking the Pokemon's LP management system. Ah, oh, I see. That is quite the revelation. Okay. Go to jail. <laughs> I did not think... Such a thing was even possible in the first place. It wasn't all that our I mean, I'm really sorry and I won't do it again. This is a matter of rather my jurisdiction, I'm afraid. I'll have to consult Miss Gitta, the Pokemon League chairwoman, on how best to proceed. I figure as much. I do apologize, Mr. Ben, but I will have to ask you to give us some privacy. Yeah, cool. Now what? Is it, is it over? Where do I have to go? Oh, here we go. Ben! Penny! Something I want to talk to you about. Can you come meet me in the front of the school stairs? You know where we first met? I'll be waiting. Yeah, cool. This episode is never gonna end. Hustle of V-Star. Six of us thought up. Oh. A catchphrase back when we created a team. It's so cringy. It's perfect, you know. <laughs> anyway, about the LP thing. I thought I was going down big time for hacking the League Point system, but they're letting me off easy. Yeah, that's great. The Pokemon League said they'll waive my debt if I do some volunteer engineering for them. They even asked me to come to work for them after I graduated, if you can believe that. Director Clavel and that Geta lady kept com complimenting me like a weird amount. Apparently, I have outstanding talent or something. Sorry for calling you out here in a meeting like this. I'm still not so great with people face to face. I never seem to find the right words, but um, 
Thank you so much. You saved Team Star, my friends, along with it. I know words won't ever be enough to properly thank you for all you've done, so here. Nice, I like that. I'm sure you'll put this to good use, and one more thing. I want you to repay the debt, I leave. If you ever think of a way I can do that, just let me know. I'm, with, I'm great with machines and hacking and stuff. So next time, I'll be the one helping you, Ben. Be seeing you then, Hostel of V-Star. Oh, thank God! It's freaking over! This might not even be one episode, or if it's two, I don't... I don't care! Does it matter? Okay, it doesn't matter. Doesn't even matter if it's two part or one, I don't even care. Okay, nothing changed, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode or episodes. I don't even I don't even know. Alright, Leaf Ford's next. Bye.